hello friends welcome back to my channel and today's video is the this is the continuation of a series that is a hashtag guide to good makeup so I have been doing a separate series this is a new year like I just wanted to tell you that I'm going I'm doing a separate series called hashtag guide to good makeup series wherein you'll be learning all like from primer till the end the setting spray that are like uh, the basic informations for beginners will be uh, shown or given uh, in this particular series so I've already done two lessons that is lesson one is primer lesson two is color characters so every like step one and step two has been completed and you can check that videos out in somewhere in I button or I'll just put it in the link, uh, description bar or at the end card so you can just check them out or there's a I have a separate playlist called hashtag guide to good makeup playlist wherein you can find all the videos relating to this particular series in that playlist now with the continuation I just wanted to uh, continue with the lesson 3 that is foundation so foundation is very important for a good flawless makeup so even without foundation you can do your makeup that is using a squeezy cream or concealer you can do it to have a full on makeup foundation is very much essential Last one, like what is a foundation so foundation is a cream or liquid or any um, materials that is used to have with a tint of color to cover up the discoloration or uh, like what to say discoloration or any flawlessness flaws which is on your face body or any region on your uh, in the makeup process so this basically it helps to give you a good canvas or give you a good flawless effect to your face second topic is what are the types of foundation you have to know what is a type of foundation which will help you to choose the correct foundation what are the types of foundation so basically as far as I, my knowledge is concerned there are four types of uh, foundations liquid foundations are easy to blend and work with and it is suitable for all skin types and most effective when used on medium to dry skin and it is effective in giving luminous finish and it does a very good job of filling and concealing fine lines and enlarged pores at least temporarily and it is very good foundation for all there are some cons too like it may look shiny when the skin has excess oil secretion and wearing the wrong liquid formation formulation for your skin can lead to cakey foundation look and it also moisturize and oil can come in fine lines and wrinkles after some hours of wear and heavy coverage may liquid may cause clogged pores Cream foundations are thick in consistency and it offers more hydration and most effective when used on dry and matured skin people can use this and it comes in various forms like pumps, tubes, compacts etc and it is highly pigmented so you need a only small quantity of product to apply for and it leaves the skin with a dewy glow and uh, there are some cons too so first one is it is not so long lasting and it tends to crease more easily and can turn shiny and move around and it is not best option for oily skin beauties only it works only on top of other creams but not on powders and it doesn't look good and you can't blend cream colors together as easily as compared to other ones next comes the powder foundation and it, it gives a matte velvety finish to the skin for an airbrush effect the, it is the best option for oily skin people and it can be blended easily and is very long lasting especially if applied on top of foundation helps absorbs natural skin oil so does not make the skin crazy can be laid with other products easily 
and it has got some corns too. That is, it is not well suited for matured skin as it settles in fine lines and wrinkles and can make, make skin feel dry or dehydrated. It is generally requires brushes or any other techniques for application. It looks uh, slightly artificial as it is on top of the skin. Two matte powders can make your skin look flat and dull. Next in the list is the Mousse Foundation and it is also called as Whipped Foundation. It is a perfect blend of liquid makeup with some sort of air whipped in it. It is light and smooth. It tends to give a perfect matte finish with a light weight feel and it is good for all skin types especially for those who have a mature skin and it helps the absorb natural oils and uh, it is very good for uh, mature skin as it is just it gives a smooth finish instead of caking up of product. And there are some cons too. It is like it is getting the wrong match mainly to have a cakey effect. And it can be messy in the application process as it is usually comes in a tub finish. So with this I conclude the part 1 of foundation in hashtag guide to good makeup series. Uh, next part. So a sneak peek of next part 2 of foundation will be the coverage of foundation and finishes of foundation please wait till next week to know what are the coverages with the examples i'm not going to just stop just saying with saying i'm going to give you a few examples so with this uh, so that is going to be the part two of foundation in this series so before that before concluding this video i'm just as you should I request you to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon next to it so that you'll not miss any of my videos if you haven't subscribed yet and I'm sure that I'm not going to disappoint you there are many videos which is going to come up next so do not miss the series and it is going to continue every Fridays and don't do not miss it so Follow me on Instagram at Samyukta Vinod and like my Facebook page Samyukta Vinod YouTube for more such updates. So thank you.